in this post covid age when most of the companies are hiring graphic designers most of the designers are not able to provide their deliverables in given time when asked for the clarification for this inefficiency most of the designers replied that when they were working from home during the covid times they were using some online tools which were helping them to initiate the graphic design for them and later they can do some certain minor tweaks and they can deliver the product to the company in the given time that's why they were able to complete all deliverables in the dedicated time period so what do you guys think are these online ai tools going to override the manual or human age of graphic designers because most of the companies are already switching to canva premium or freepik premium because they provide the same or if not better results than hiring a dedicated mediocre graphic designer an interesting topic isn't it so let's drop the intro Before starting this video, if you guys are new here, my name is Shambhu Das, and I am a professional graphic designer, video editor, and UI UX designer. In this channel, we talk about tips, tricks, and tutorials about graphic designing, video editing, and UI UX designing. So, if you are into it, then consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. As we have seen, there are many emerging solutions for online designing, which are AI based. Some of them are Adobe Spark, Canva, Freepik, and the list is endless. Most of the companies, or if not most of the modern companies, are actually switching to these online tools completely for their workflow. Due to COVID and stuff, most of the companies have limited funds. Thus, they are finding out alternative ways than hiring a dedicated graphic designer. I mean, why not? Most of these graphic designers themselves use these online tools while working from their home. These tools are actually provide very asterisk services than compared to other dedicated designers. they are relatively cheaper in price and they provide a very quick service which is not possible by any human hiring a designer means engaging more employees and the employer related cost of the companies increases and also these employees or graphic designers have more rejection rates than online tools the employees or the graphic designers as in humans suffer from creative block which is not experienced by ai online tools so the major question is will these online based ai services will override the manual age of designers as i'm a fan of upfront conclusions the simple answer is no these online tools are not eating out the job of regular graphic designers see most of the time and almost all the time when there is an ai based online tool there should be a library which is accompanying it this is how ai works so this library or this secret society have a major chunk of data from where the ai algorithm feeds this chunk of data and builds a new product and shows it to the public this is how ai works in general these online tools which are making creative designs is also backed up by a feed of library which have many creative designs in it the ai algorithm takes and searches inspiration from this online library and builds new product So as you can already imagine there is a bunch of designers who are hired by these companies scattered all over the world who are secretly contributing to this secret society of the library this group of designers are much more expert in their field and pro in their own universe so these designers are never losing their job because of this online revolution so the million dollar question is how you can register yourself in the super pro group of graphic designers number 1 Most of these online based companies organize hackathons and designathons where these companies ask designers all across the globe to send them graphic designs or creative designs using their own online tools. These hackathons or designathons are wild card entry to the super professional group of designers. Most of the designers across the globe after participating in these hackathons and designathons come directly in contact with the companies and these companies can ask them direct invitation for joining the super pro group of designers number 2 take more and more courses not just for learning but to receive daily newsletters from these eminent companies most of these companies will start sending you daily newsletters after you start enrolling for their courses don't just uh, ignore them up front because they don't always contain useless messages Sometimes they contain useful information such as hiring job offers, vacancies for joining their backend community, etc. 
so don't just ignore them you can get certain job offers from these newsletters as well number 3 attend more and more design summits and make more contact with various entrepreneurs and businessmen you can also make free templates for these companies like free pick and canva so that you can market yourself in these marketplaces so these are some of the ways by which you can gain access to the secret society and overcome the vulnerability of losing your job as a designer so that's it for today's video guys hope you have enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell icon so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video till then stay creative and i hope to see you in my next video